Welcome to our continuing series, Questions and Answers, from the works of Sri Aurobindo and the Mother. Today's subject, Openness and Opening, Part 1, from the Mother. Openness is the will to receive and to utilize for progress the force and influence. The constant aspiration to remain in touch with the consciousness. The faith that the force and consciousness are always with you, around you, inside you, and that you have only to let nothing stand in the way of your receiving them. Opening is a release of the consciousness by which it begins to admit into itself the workings of the divine light and power. Open to the consciousness which is working on and in you and keep always as quiet and peaceful as you can. Disciple, I pray that I may serve you consciously and sincerely without the least encroachment or hampering by the ego and be inspired by you in everything. Mother, open yourself more and more to the consciousness and you will receive inspiration. 9 May 1934 The opening to the divine light cannot be made through coercion. 12 June 1939 To open more to love and to the light. This is exactly the answer I sent to your last letter. Rise higher in the consciousness, love more widely, open to the light, and all divergences will disappear. You must be as vast and comprehensive as the world to do the yoga. 2nd August 1962 If you open yourself to the force and the help, there will be no strain. 14 December 1963 Opening. The help is constant in all the domains. It is for us to know how to benefit from it. Integral opening of the being towards the divine, the first step of the ascent. From Sri Aurobindo, always keep open to the mother's force. Let the inner consciousness develop. Only that will help and deliver from all difficulties as the openness in the physical grows in you. 12 January 1935 Disciple My mind is not yet quiet and that is why I am not getting any joy in my sadhana, any experience or realization, nothing at all. This makes me very sad and unhappy. May the Mother bestow on me the flow of peace and help me to open my closed heart center. Sri Arbindo, there has always been too much reliance 
on the action of your own mind and will. That is why you cannot progress. If you could once get the habit of silent reliance on the power of the mother, not merely calling it in to support your own effort, the obstacle would diminish and eventually disappear. 14 July 1929 There is no aspiration in me no capacity to follow something higher. I feel dullness inside, but I do feel quiet from the pressure on my head. I must be patient and keep faith. Then you will make me conscious. Sri Aurobindo, quietude first. With it, Confidence in the mother's force that is working on you. When the physical mind is obliged to be quiet, it has this impression of inactivity and dullness at first. When it opens more and more to the force, that impression will disappear. 12 November 1932 The depression has come upon you because you accepted the thought that you were not doing what you should do and not using the chance Mother had given you. Such thoughts should never be indulged for they open the door to depression, and depression opens the door to the old movements. They used to come formerly from the idea that you were unfit. Now it is the idea that you are not doing all you ought to do.